Hello, my name is Mike Driscoll, and today I'm going to teach you how to merge dictionaries in Python. What you're going to learn, there are three different ways to merge dictionaries. There may even be more, but these are the most common methods. You can use the dictionaries update method, you can use the double star method, or you can use the union operator if you have a new enough version of Python. Let's start by merging with the update method. So let's say we have two dictionaries, dictionary one, dictionary two, they have different contents in them. And to update one, you can do dictionary one dot update and then pass it the other dictionary. When you do this, it will add to the two dictionaries together, but only in dictionary one. If we were to print out just dictionary two, it would remain the same. Note that if I changed this to name and then I did the update, to dictionary one, it will overwrite um, the name in dictionary one. So let's run this and you can see that it is updated and now name is content creation. Now let's take a look at the next way to merge two dictionaries using the double star method. So we have dictionary one and dictionary two. To merge them together, you can say dictionary three equals dictionary star star dictionary one comma star star dictionary two. What this will do is it'll take out the keys and the values of the dictionaries and kind of explode them into the dictionary. If we run this code, you can see that it goes ahead and does exactly what I did with the update method, except that we're now we're creating a separate dictionary, dictionary three. All right. Starting in Python 3.9, they added a third way to do this using the union method, method, or the union operator. The union operator is this little bar sign, or a pipe, as some people call it in Linux land. It kind of cleans up the code a little bit because now you don't have to specify that you're doing a dic dictionary using the curly braces. Instead, you can just say dictionary three equals dictionary one pipe, or union operator, dictionary two, and it works exactly the same as the double star method did. And you end up with a new dic dictionary. Again, in either the double star or the union operator, if I was to change this to name, the second dictionary would override the first dictionary. And so if we rerun this, you can see that now name is content creation instead of Mike, which probably isn't what you want, but it's something you need to be aware of when you're merging dictionaries in that the other dictionaries in there could technically overwrite other dictionaries. Also of note, um, you don't have to just do this with one, with two dictionaries, it could be two or more. So theoretically, you know, I could do a dictionary three here, and a dictionary four here, etc. And it would still merge them together, with still the problem of possible key collisions overwriting each other. And this would also work uh, with the double star method, uh, if you wanted to do it that way. All right. Let's uh, review. Today I showed you how to use the update method, which is a dictionary method, to update one dictionary with another dictionary. Then I showed you how to merge two dictionaries together using the double star method. And finally, I showed you how to use the union operator, which is only available in Python 3.9 and above. Thank you so much for watching. I hope I'll see you next time.